Huh? You say something? What's your name? Hmm. Lonnie called you Red, right? Last mention of her, Lonnie. So his name's Amaranth, but I already know the name, so... Yeah. And, uh... I'm sending you this vid, because I told you I would. So... Have fun watching this, like, one little piece. Flaming Brian. <laughs> Fine. We'll call you Brian. What if you felt like a stupid name, like a curse word? FF, if anyone gets that reference. The more, the merrier. Let's decide our marching order. Um, so now you actually get to choose your party members, besides me, because I'm the main guy and I'm also no, I'm kidding. But, um... Hmm. Well, I want to learn more stones with Lanny, so... Even though Mei has better white magic, I'd rather have... Um more attack power at this point because we're gonna have some good fights coming so yeah we should be ready and I think yeah every new party member is actually the uh what's it called the average of your characters because like all these people are 23 and then he's 23 so yeah alright we'll do fine just follow me in real life next stop the life retreat I wouldn't care. I would just pick everyone up and say we're all going to fight together because I'm too lazy to actually change the members. Which I mean, yeah, it's a video game so you really can't do that because then it just kills the whole fact of being able to be creative with who you want to pick. So, he doesn't have a hat. Might as well give him one. Counter. You should have counter with him. He's really, like, this is where the claws come into play and everything. But yeah, counter is a good one for him. We don't really need Beast Killer. I want Antibody on it. So I'm gonna give him that. Yeah, every character you get actually starts out with really bad equipment. And this is actually your last party member. Sorry to spoil it, but yeah. Out of best. I might as well keep that. Um, I want Body Temp on him, but those are pretty good. So I'll give him that afterwards. HP 10%, Burst Stun, and I'm dead. Counter. And now I'm antibody. So for claws, actually. Oh, he actually has counter on that. Wow. That's funny. Um yeah, it takes a while to master. Chakra is good. And spare chain is actually not that good in this game. It's better in ten. I'll keep him with the cast claws for now. And as you can see it ups his by 10. But once I master uh, Chakra, then I'll equip him with the next one. So yeah. I think what you want here is bright eyes and antibody for your next part. So we're going back to the life retreat. So I just have those ready. Oh god, I still don't get this camera control. It's confusing me. <laughs> um, I'll show one battle since we already seen all these things. I'll show one. If I get into one, which I probably will, just to show off how he plays or whatever. But when I get to the life retreat, I'm gonna cut because there's actually a part there where I my disc freezes, so I don't want to risk it this time. I'll do it next time, so then when I start, I can get pissed off instead of having to get pissed off at the end right now. <laughs> if that makes any sense. This last video is gonna be pretty short, but sorry guys. It's what I have to do. Wow, I'm gonna be pretty mad if this actually happens. Okay, never mind, it didn't happen. So, what is this? This is a goblin. Why a goblin? Oh, we get a back attack. That's perfect. And I'm still not healed. I thought I was actually healed. Damn it. So they didn't sleep, pretty much. This is like BS. Alright, fine. Well, I'm gonna deal with him. So, flares is basically a special attacks. He's like a monk. You can throw all of your items that you have, pretty much. But later on, you get better items to throw. And attack is basically what I use with him. He's really weak right now, but he actually does get pretty strong. Especially when you use counter. 
counter only works when you have, um, ow, you have, um, been attacked physically, so, not a magic attack. You can have magic counter. I think it's called, like, return magic. He has that too. But, uh, it's not really worth it to... Well, not really not worth it. Counter doesn't really work that way. Oh, I know why he's doing bad damage, because he's in the back row. Which, I don't know why they put him in there. Because I guess he's supposed to be a thrower guy, or someone who's more defensive. God damn it, BB. <laughs> I think he's supposed to be someone who's, like, more throw oriented so you're supposed to stand back and use magic with him but right now we don't have any so what's the point of keeping him in the back oh he's in the front what <laughs> why is he doing such bad damage never mind i don't know i'm confusing myself there should be a place to save up here i hope there is because i don't want my disc to freeze i'm pretty sure there is there's still a little mist, but at least there's no more coming out. That must mean Kuja isn't here yet. Incredible powers. He sounds like some, I don't know, guy with a deep voice. It's him. He flew from the ruins of Burmesia riding a silver dragon. It's Kuja, all right, and he's riding that dragon. We actually do fight that dragon. Not now, but later. I'm thinking like this war. So, yeah. If you thought disc 2 was pretty long, don't worry, it's almost done. Who do I want to take with you? Like, I, you don't have to worry about it right now. Cause like, you're gonna come, you're gonna... Blah, you're gonna do it again later, right before you fight it. But actually, I don't know if there's a save point. So, instead of actually going through this, I'm gonna save and then go through all that next time. So, hopefully you enjoyed. This has been Priest, and thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time when we go into the life of tree and try to take down Kuja. I don't know how else to say that, but yeah. Um, see you guys till then. See ya.